Hello. Today we're going to do a video review of Jurassic Park Tyrannosaurus. Yeah. So, as you can see, I got a new background sort of thing. I got my old sound, got this sound system, but I traded it for the old one, you know. But, so yeah, just, you know, this is my first video review in a long time. So, enjoy. Okay. So, as usual, we're going to go right into detail. Now, detail on this figure is very nice. I, I like its detail. Looks very like the movie, sorta. Not too much. Has like crests. Kind of looks like Allosaurus with crests on its eyes. It's green, so, you know. So yeah, and I uh, like all Jurassic Park toys. You got your scratched rib show on meat cage thing, rib cage. Like others, like other Jurassic Park toys. You got like Spinosaurus over here. Yeah. So yeah. Now, Tyrannosaurus, um, I only got him laying down because you can't really see him on camera. But yeah. So let's get his full rotation. He got 360. You just gotta. Nope. He kind of stops at the arm here. But yeah. Funny thing is, um, his tail goes 360. <laughs> Don't see that very often. Both hands go 360. Head doesn't have any articulation. Mouth goes up and down. Roll the jaw. You know. That's really all the articulation. Both of these uh, move 360. And, oops. I mean, as you can see there. 360. Um, so yeah. Color scheme. You got the red. Yellowish color, he's green. He's got these weird thingies, which I should add in detail. He's got these weird lines. And then you got the black going down his uh, going down his back and going down the tail as well. So yeah. And then you got the black fingernails all the way. You got yellow eye, black pupil. Um, you got yellow eye, black pupil, you know. You got the nostrils, that's nice. So, very nice toy, actually. Now for the comparison. Um, just gotta stand him up. If I can make him stand, is all. The thing is, I need to make him stand. See if I balance him on something. Can I balance him on this? Let's see. Let's see. Sorry if I'm wasting your time. It's just, I need to get this on. No? Don't wanna stand up? Wanna stand up for us? Come on, stand. Yeah, I'm just gonna hold him. You know. So here he's next to Spinosaurus. Yay, Spinosaurus can stand. All right. So there he's next to Spinosaurus. Hold on. Let me just focus. Let me just put it down for a minute. All right. There he is next to. It. Come on. Stay. There he's next to Spinosaurus. Very good size. There. Now that we have comparison, let's get back. So, um, totally recommend him, you know, if you have the chance. I got him at Universal Studios, you know. I didn't know owned. Um, Universal Studios. I think you can get online, maybe, maybe, you know, reasonable price, I got him for like $10, and he got, he came with a Velociraptor and a, um, a baby T-Rex, but you know, I don't think I have that anymore, maybe I lost it, <laughs> sorry about that, uh, it came with a nice box, mm, yeah, so if you're a good Jurassic Park fan, I totally recommend just picking this up. If you ever go to Universal or any other place you can find it. Um, so, yeah. Um, any other thing I don't like? Anything I don't like? There's this weird thing on the bottom. I don't know if this is just mine. But, 
I don't even know what that is. Yeah. And these giant screw holes. You don't see that on Spinosaurus. Oh, and the fact it doesn't make noises. That's, that's one thing. So, yeah. I give this a 3 out of 5, you know? Uh, yeah. So, um, first video review in a long time. Hope you enjoyed it. Rate, comment, all that. Thank you, and goodbye.